In this tutorial, we will guide you on how to render the composition in Adobe After Effects CS6. First of all, trim the working area till the end of the composition. Now you can see the total duration of composition. Once done, go to the Composition tab and select the Add to Render Queue option. A new tab will be added next to the New Composition tab. In order to have the best compatible formats, click at the Best Settings option next to the Render Settings menu. Once the Render Settings window appears, set the quality to Best, Resolution to Full, and Disk Cache to Read. Select On for Checked Layers from the Frame Blending menu and leave the rest of the options as they are. With that done, click on OK, move to the Output module and click on Lossless next to it. Expand the Format menu and select that format which is compatible with your playback device. Now move to the Format option, where you can select the video codecs in order to compress the video. For this tutorial, we won't be selecting any video codec, as we don't want to compromise on the quality of the output. You can also resize the dimensions of the video by manually arranging them or using the given presets. The Crop option can help you remove unwanted area from the frame, while the Audio Output settings gives you the opportunity to customize its frequency. Move to the Color Management tab and tick on the checkbox titled Preserve RGB. This is if you want your video to be seen as desaturated. Uncheck the option if you want the output in color. Review the settings again and click on OK. Click to the new .avi option next to the output to option and select the path where you want your output to be saved. Select the errors only from the logs menu. This will give you an idea the rendering was unsuccessful. Tick on the checkbox next to the New Comp option from the Render Queue tab and click on the Render button towards the right side of the screen. You can see now that the composition is being rendered.